The warmest of welcomes to you. We await the conclusion of the pre-game formalities. The teams then, Lazio against Inter. I'm Peter Drury, and here with me in the commentary box, I'm glad to report, is Jim Beglin. Thanks for the intro, Peter. I've been soaking up the atmosphere, and I'm really looking forward to what lies in store. Just the wrong outcome. Maro Icardi certainly could have and should have made more of that. Inter certainly won't want to look back and, and dwell on that. It was a good chance, though. Aimed long and direct. Barolo. And it's Caicedo. in a foot to win it back Lazio whose last result owes so much to the astuteness of their manager look to alter the intended game plan was a daring move on the manager's part it wasn't quite working for him and he accepted his mistake and I think what followed merits a lot of praise Icardi Candreva with the ball header goal Inter are certainly a team that knows how to play their football as stylishly as you'll see. Tiki Taka at its very best, and they back it up with goals. to Milan, take the early advantage. Lucas. So, they got the only goal to make it 1-0. Carolo with a long pass out wide. Bernard. Forward it goes. Brozovic. Battles to win it back. He's had a shot! Saved only by poor finishing. Lazio really have been deserted by their composure and allowed frustration to take over, and it's not a good sign. Into Milan the most prolific team in the league this season. And it's Immobile. It's Immobile! He's got away with one there. Solo strike gave his team a first-half lead in his last game. Steered out wide. Now the pass. Caicedo. Felipe! 
Felipe Anderson! Passes it through. Hits one! And Trevor. Caicedo looks to slip it through. Immobile hits it! D'Ambrosio plays it forward. He's made sure that that won't get through. And it's Caicedo. Now it's in shoots! Oh, great save, real class. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. to get it forward quickly and the first 45 minutes are up so there you have it a close sport half of football but one that still had its moments but ultimately produced just one goal they want to maintain the momentum now and finish the job into milan come off having scored the only goal of the move to deny runners the opportunity of of going beyond that rear guard goes wide That's a half-decent try. Repelled by the keeper. Lucas. Can he put it away? That's what has to be. Shot at goal! That is wayward. Yeah, on another occasion, all that went wrong may come right. England's massive leap! And in it goes! A two goal lead, and they're firmly in control. A lovely header, but really, it was all about the delivery. Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Into Milan. Have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. Well, at 1-0, this contest was still nicely poised, but now that it's gone to two, mindsets are affected a lot more. Winning belief one way and that losing feeling the other. Foul and a free kick in a very dangerous area. It's been lenient here. I doubt he'll get too many more chances. Plenty of them waiting inside the box. Diving header! And a second time! Oh, it looked like 3 0 for sure. He'll be fuming with himself for not converting. He could have killed it off. Day to 
unpredictable as to what level of impact can be made from here. It's, it's pretty late. Bernard. Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? Oh, that's a real stopper. He's put an end to the threat. No complaints about that challenge. Robust but fair. It's Immobile! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Immobile! He's done very well to get to that. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Lazio making another change here. Well, his stamina was called into question then, but there's absolutely nothing wrong with his heart and, and the efforts he put in. He was very willing, though, not quite able. Lazio being made to look sloppy in possession here. And the referee brings it to a close. Inter Milan always looked the more driven side, probably the better side, and nobody is arguing about the results. How would you summarise what we've seen today then, Jim? Inter had a very... Thank you